Welcome back to QuantifiedStrategies.com. Have you ever wondered, what are the odds of losing money if you invest in the stock market for the long haul? Maybe you're thinking about investing for retirement, a dream house, or your kid's future, but you're worried about losing it all. Today, we're diving into the data to answer one big question. What's the probability of losing money in the stock market over the long term? The numbers might surprise you. Stick around, hit that like button, and let's get started. Here's the thing. The longer you stay invested, the smoother that ride gets. Today, we're focusing on long-term investing, specifically holding stocks for 10 years or more. Why? Because time is your secret weapon in the market. To understand this, we're looking at the S&P 500, a benchmark that tracks 500 of America's biggest companies. To figure out the odds of losing money, we use something called rolling returns. This means we look at every possible 10-year period in the S&P 500's history, like 1929 to 1939, 1930 to 1940, and so on. It's like rewinding history to see how often investors came out ahead or lost money. This gives us a clear picture of what to expect over a decade. So, what do the numbers say? Based on historical data from 1929 to today, the probability of losing money in the S&P 500 over a 10-year period is about 6%. That means there's a 94% chance you'll make money if you hold for a decade. Pretty reassuring, right? Compare that to shorter time frames. Over a single day, you've got a 46% chance of losing money. Almost a coin toss. But as you stretch your investment horizon to 10 years, the odds of losing drop dramatically. That's the magic of staying patient. Now, there are rare cases where 10-year returns were negative, like during the Great Depression or the 2000s after the dot-com bust and financial crisis. But even in those tough times, the market eventually recovered. Long-term investing is way safer than short-term trading. So why is the risk so low over 10 years? There are three big reasons. One, economic growth. Over time, companies grow, economies expand, and stock prices follow. Two, dividends. Many S&P 500 companies pay dividends, which you can reinvest to boost your returns. Third, market recovery. Even after crashes, like the 57% drop in 2007 to 2009, the market has always bounced back. Since 1957, the S&P 500 has averaged a 10.13% annual return, or about 6.37% after inflation since 1960. All right, so the odds are in your favor, but how do you make the most of long-term investing? Here are three quick tips. One, invest in broad indexes. Stick with low-cost S&P 500 ETFs like SPY or VOOO to diversify your risk. 2. Stay the course. Don't panic during market dips. History shows they're temporary. 3. Think long-term. Plan for at least 10 years to maximize your chances of success. So there you have it. The probability of losing money in the stock market long-term is super low. Around 6% over 10 years, thanks to the power of time and growth. If you found this video helpful, smash that like button, hit subscribe, and ring the bell so you never miss a video.